Carlos, this morning we're hearing from local political leaders who are reacting to this news. Yeah, Kirsten, and they all agree it comes at a crucial time, just 32 days before the presidential election and two weeks before the next presidential debate. We spoke with Sacramento County Republican Party uh, Chair Betsy Mahan, who says this will bring drastic changes to the president's campaign, but she says it won't impact the stability of the country and his hopes for re-election. And although it's almost certain that the remaining two debates will be canceled or drastically changed because the president will most likely be isolated until then, she says it won't affect the election's outcome. You know, let's be frank. Most people have already made up their mind as to how they're going to vote in this election. The the only unknown thing is whether the people who have just kind of tuned the election out are going to show up or not. Local Democratic leaders are also weighing in this morning. State Senator Dr. Richard, Richard Pan, rather, who represents Sacramento, tweeting, quote, over 200,000 Americans have already died of COVID-19. I pray that our president and first lady will remain in good health. But I sincerely hope our president will not then dismiss the seriousness of this disease. Hashtag wear a mask. Now, Mahan says the president has always taken the pandemic seriously by dedicating time and resources to respond to it and that he and the first lady have always followed safety guidelines by wearing a mask and practicing physical distancing. She also says she doesn't think this will change the Republican Party's message on COVID-19, Kirsten. All right. We hope they have a swift recovery. Thank you for that, Carlos.